Welcome to Fillable Document. We are thrilled to introduce an extraordinary document generation tool. Fillable Document is a comprehensive document workflow automation solution designed exclusively for Google Workspace. With our innovative platform, you can effortlessly visualize your data and capture all your information with ease. Our advanced features enable you to generate professional quality documents and seamlessly deliver them to your intended recipients. Experience the power of fillable document and revolutionize your document management process. Now let's get started in setting up the fillable document. For the fillable document form, for example, I choose a client feedback form that has fields for mapping. Next, I choose a client feedback document to map the form fields with the dynamic fields. Introduce dynamic fields to transform your document into an interactive fillable form. There are two types of dynamic fields available, dollar curly brackets and double curly brackets. Let's customize the client feedback document as a fillable form with dynamic fields. For example, make the client name a dynamic field. In the same way, you can utilize dynamic fields according to your needs for your document. With these dynamic fields in place, your document template is now ready to become a fully fillable template. We have customized the document as a fillable form template to generate. Let's open the fillable document add-on from the extensions. When you open the fillable document for the first time, a setup page will be displayed. Now, let's see the start setup option. Click on start setup and you will be presented with two options, automatic setup and manual setup. For the manual setup, we will go through the steps one by one, allowing you to choose the document template and perform any necessary steps. However, for now, let's choose automatic setup. This option will complete all the steps automatically for you. Automatic processes are completed. Just click explore now. When opening the fillable document for the first time, it shows the document template section. It offers two options, generate sample and add template. Simply click generate sample to create a document choosing your preference and it automatically appends your form fields as a dynamic field in that document. Click add template to choose a template from the drive. Now, for example, click add template and I choose the already prepared client feedback document. You can delete templates using the delete icon as needed. You can refresh the document to get dynamic fields. Open the template. By default, templates are generated in both the chosen document and PDF formats. If you want more formats, select the desired file format for generating it. However, native Google document formats like Doc, Sheet, and Slide cannot have the format changed. To share the generated document, click the share icon, provide the recipient's email, and select the desired permission. This allows for easy document sharing after generating. Finally, save the document template changes. Below that, you can see the field mapping section. Now, let's see what the mapping is. Mapping is nothing but assigning a document field value with the form field's value. Let's see how it works. You can refresh the form to get new values for mapping. In the field mapping, we have two rows for each mapping, your respective document fields are listed in the first row. In the second row, we choose a form's questions from a drop-down. This allows us to map the form field value to the desired document field. If you have the document dynamic field name and form field name the same, it intelligently does the automatic mapping. Now, for manual mapping, let's take an example. 
I have a client name in my document, so for the dynamic field, I want to map the value of name from the form fields, so I choose the form field value to the document field. In this way, you can map all form field values to the respective document's fields. Click the delete icon to delete the mapping. Finally, save your mapping changes. Now, let's proceed to the destination section. Click on the menu option and go to destination. In the data store section, your data is stored in a destination spreadsheet. If you want, you can modify it by choosing a different spreadsheet or creating a new one. Click the Open in New icon to view your spreadsheet and give a sheet name to create a sheet tab to store your data. In the File Store section, you have the flexibility to choose a different folder or create a new folder where the generated documents will be stored. If you wish to modify the format of the generated document names, click the three dot icon and select the fields to include in the document name. By default, the setup includes the template name, date, and time. Now, let's move to the Email Template section. In the Email Template section, you'll find a default email template for sending messages to recipients. Edit the template by clicking on the Edit icon and make changes to the template name, from name, and recipient's email address according to your preferences. You can include the generated attachments in the email. Use Add Drive File Attachment to select files from your Google Drive as static attachments. You can also clone the email template, delete email templates, and add email templates as needed. Let's explore the Collaborators section. Click the menu, go to Collaborators, and click the Add icon. Enter the email address and add the user as a collaborator. To remove a user, click the Delete icon. They'll have access to the fillable document and its settings to make necessary adjustments. Enhance collaboration by adding users as collaborators. After completing all the configurations, return to the home page, and let's proceed to learn how to generate documents. In the configuration section, you will find a list of the configurations we have set up, including document templates, email templates, and output storage. This layout makes it convenient to navigate to the respective sections by clicking on the corresponding icons. Moving on to the Control Center section, you can enable the Automate Form Submission option to automate the process of form submissions. Enabling this option will facilitate the automatic generation of your documents and the sending of emails. You will also have the ability to manage the generated documents and send emails as necessary. Let's take a look at the form submission process. After you have finished configuring everything, access your form and proceed to fill in the required fields. Once you have accurately completed the form, you can proceed to submit it. Now, navigate to your email inbox to find the email message. In the email, you will find both static attachments and documents generated by the fillable document as attachments. Click on the attachment to view the document that was generated based on the submitted information. For your convenience, the client feedback form and template have been provided in the description. Kindly review them. 
Thank you for watching this video. We hope you are enjoying our fillable form experience.